hi guys hello everyone welcome back to my channel this morning i'm not smiling i am hungry so i just found out there's a thing that happens but i don't know if it's all around canada i don't know if it happens everywhere of it's just here so i decided to um you know record this video acid day hot so that you guys can see my real-time reaction to this so this is what happened guys <laughs> i'm ready for my story i hope you guys can hear me loud and clear i'm on the road i hope the sound of the cars are not interfering with what i'm saying <sighs> So guys, I ordered something, right? Um, well, because, what's today now? It's first week of February, Sha. I shall ordered something for um, Valentine's Day. Not really for Valentine's Day, for, yes, because I have a brand work that I'm supposed to do for, to be released, like something in accordance with Valentine's Day. And also, you know because i also had an event um a couple's thing and i just wanted to get myself a nice dress right so that was how i got on my computer and i ordered two beautiful dresses for myself and something for my daughter right and oh of course you wait payment confirmation so on tuesday the delivery guy called me and said oh He's at my apartment, but he can't get access into the beauty because usually I have to buzz them in. But I left for work and I said, okay, well, I'm not here now. What can you do? He said he's going to come back on Saturday. So, Saturday I was actually expecting a call from him. But I didn't get any call from him. So I just thought that, okay, well, maybe he's no longer, you know, dropping it off on saturday so only for me to get a mail and then we went for my daughter has a ballet classes on saturday and if i go for ballet on saturdays so we left for ballet and then i got a mail saying that um my order has been delivered check your mailbox check the front of your apartment door and all of those kind of things right so i was like okay well let we get home now I'll just go and check for my package and um, you know it came right in time for the event I needed it for and I was so glad and happy that yes my package has arrived lo and behold I go home first of all when we go home my husband went to check the mailbox I said I have a delivery he went to check the mailbox and I just went ahead and checked the front of the door there was nothing there and I was like, um, I don't get it. What exactly is happening right now? So I waited for a moment and said, okay, well, maybe um, the person is still going to come or there's still going to be a note for me to go and pick it up in the nearest Canada Post or something like that. Fast forward to two days after, I went to check my profile to track the package and it says i have signed for it i said signed for what i don't understand what did i sign for how is it that i signed for it well i decided to go to their contact support their um support thing and said okay oh order delivered my um package says or oh, when i track my package it says order delivered but not received please what is happening and then this morning they replied me guys i'm just walking back home from high first school so let me get in okay i will continue from there hi guys so i am back home let me see so i'm back home guys welcome back so Fast forward to this morning, I got a response from the support guys of the company I ordered the dresses from. And they go, um, your order has been signed for, it has been delivered and signed for, and they sent me the evidence. 
so the evidence they sent me is that um i the of course not that i actually received it myself they showed me the screenshots of the front the door of my apartment saying that oh yes this is the package being delivered at your door and this is your apartment number delivered you know all that kind of like an evidence from the career guy that okay oh, i have delivered this and i was like what is this is this is this a thing here does this happen is this you know i was just i was amazed i was my mouth was ajar that my god i just spent money buying these things because i needed them so 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 time and then they are telling me this how is that how is that even possible that um this could have happened so i asked the resident manager right that okay so there's a problem does this ever happen or has anyone ever complained of this happening because this is what happened i did i ordered for something and then um i didn't get it but i was told it has been delivered and there's an evidence that shows that it has been delivered to my doorstep and then she goes oh yeah that's a thing it's called um they are called um parcel pirates and I was like, I don't understand. <laughs> People, help me. People of God, help me. I, I really don't understand. I'm still trying to understand this. Guys, if you live in Canada, anywhere in Canada, or precisely if you live in Winnipeg, and you've ever experienced this, please let me know in the comment section. Because I don't understand. So the thing even is that, so I have a new resolution. If I'm ordering anything, and I'm advising everybody to, if I am ordering anything, I'm either going to have it picked up at the nearest um, courier service or whatever. Because if this is a thing, then why is it, why does no one, or maybe it's just me who doesn't know about it because I'm new. Like, even people in houses, people live in their own houses, people who live in their own houses, right? They also suffer this kind of thing. That is, they have maybe Korea people drop something off for them. And then maybe a few hours back, they check and they don't find their parcels. Like, what kind of thing is this? This is daylight robbery now. I mean, what do you think, guys? This is daylight robbery. And to think that my apartment is just somewhere. It's not even somewhere in the open that everyone can easily. So that means, does it mean that there are people who go around uh to scavenge or to check for parcels that have been dropped at people's doors or something i still don't understand i don't get it guys i i, I am this morning eh, i just said i have to record it as it day hot as it happened because this is new to me this is totally new to me like and i heard again that it's a thing it's actually a thing where people um order something and they, they don't get their delivery they don't get their parcel guys help me i need help <laughs> This is new to me. I need help. I need help. We're in Canada for Christ's sake. I need help, guys. So this is what happened to me. I said I should come and tell you guys. So if you are anywhere in Canada, if this has ever happened to you, please let me know. And also an advice if you are ordering something. If you know that you know your I don't know. If you know that just you won't be at home yes and the bad part or the most annoying part of it i i don't know if you guys saw one of my videos when i was recording something and i just heard like there was someone at the door so sometimes they even drop these parcels out your door and they don't even knock on your door to say okay oh, i'm dropping something off they just drop it off and go you know so even if at your even if you're at home at times it happens and then you don't even know something has been dropped so my resident manager also said oh there are times that if she knows that she's going to get a package she keeps checking at the door every minute because they drop it off and they go they just take a picture like they're not even doing their own due diligence to let the owner of the person know that this thing has been delivered there's no call there's nothing they just drop it off and say oh parcel delivered and then what happens after is none of their business now as it is my money is gone uh the event or the purpose of ordering those dresses is defeated and guys i'm just hungry please i'm hungry i don't know what to say i'm hungry please eh at the end of this please just put something in the comment section let me know if you've ever, ever experienced this in canada and um i don't know really i don't know so bye guys see you later <laughs>
<laughs> See you in the next video, guys. Bye.